Going to give this time to the tailback. And another mistake here defensively as a flag is down Personal on the foul. tackle. And that's going to attack on 15 Defense. more. They're down here in the fourth, and that personal foul penalty is not going to help. Right. No, in these types of situations, players will tell you that extra right. intensity from where we sit right. is actually frustration. Right there, right there, right there. Right there. Man, that's the trash. That's trash. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the third. Now whistles and a timeout call here. Not sure of the point of this, but they'll stop it with four seconds to go in the game. Oh, they'll give it here to his running back. And he takes it in for the score on the game's final play. So it doesn't affect Give me the ball the every time, fella. I'm going to score. On top to their end. Or as our friends in Bayou Country would say, that's a little land, yeah, a little extra on top. One of the fun parts about working with you is that we've learned that there are different ways to do things than the way we were brought up to do them. This is mad, and of course they were going to go ahead and get another score. What do you mean, take a knee? And that just makes the final margin even more lopsided. Well, my friend, for the players, it's good for them to get that first game under their belts. For you and I, that first Thursday night game, also good for us to get that under our belts, wasn't it? It was no longer preseason. We were into the regular season, the first game of the year. And you know, all eyes were watching this when everyone was excited that football was back. It is just special. You can just feel it. It's so good to have the picks get back out there. It'll be crisp fall weather before we know it. You got that right, but I love the build-up to it, right? All day long anticipating it. And then we got here and we saw a game, the first game of the year. Let's keep going. So for Denver, they begin the new campaign with a victory here in front of the home crowd in the Thursday opener. And they'll get a few extra days to savor this one before they take on the Cleveland Browns.